Hey, yo, Luba. What's going on, everyone? Trey out of Compton here, back at again with another video. So, and a different type of video. It is a rulings video. And how something that came from the comment section actually had me pay attention to a little ruling in Edison format regarding Phoenix and Cluster Amaryllis and DB Warrior Lady. First of all, I got to say, 73 subscribers. We're on our way over to 100. We're 27 away. So, Hit that like, comment, and subscribe button just so we get a little bit more views. We're hitting double digits on the likes. We're growing, baby. We're growing. And, of course, the comments are getting spicier and abundant as well. So appreciate all the support so far. So I, I want to turn attention back over to this comment right here. And I first read that, and I was like, whoa, buddy, Alejandro Arias, 419. What's going on here? Cluster Emeralds can't be banished by DD Warrior Lady. And I'm like... How can it not, right? DD Lawyer Lady is a clear out against this deck. Um, no ifs, ands, and buts, but, but, but. We ended up looking a little further, myself and, and my man, Sam. My man, Sam, we looked a little further, and it actually turns out that when Cluster Amaryllis attacks a DD Warrior Lady, War Amaryllis destroys itself by its own effect before DD Warrior Lady is able to banish. Yes, Ladies and gentlemen, that is correct. So how does this work, right? Now, this, did you know this ruling? Did you know this ruling here? That's, that's, the, and that's going to be the title of this video presentation. So first off, let's go over the damage step for a second. There are seven sub steps within a damage step. So they couldn't have made this more complicated than it already is. We all know the damage step is this crazy phase within the game that, it's a, it's a no man's land. It's like the Wild West in here, which is absolutely correct, right? So um, it turns out that the sub-step for Amaryllis applies after the damage calculation is where does the card. This is where sub-destruct effects apply. A manual chain is built at that point too. And then there's resolve effects where DD Warrior Lady, because it's not a mandatory effect, moves into the separate sub-chain, meaning that that's how it's able to beat that. And, and you might ask like, are you sure about that? Are you really sure? Yes, I am really sure. You bring up the card text on these cards. It might read exactly the same, right? Amaryllis reads, if this card is destroyed, it says, the, it, not this one. If this card attacked, it is destroyed after damage calculator. Okay, calculation. You read DD War Lady, it says, after damage calculation, when this card battles a monster, you can banish that monster. But because this thing destroys itself, that's not how this works. And it might read it's the same, but here's a clear ruling. Clear, clear ruling from edisonformat.com between DV Warrior Lady and Phoenix and Cluster Amarillo. So this effect activates in sub-step six, resolve effects out of the damage step. Whereas if you look at Amaryllis here, the continuous effect applies immediately in sub-step five, right? So after the applied this effect built, before any chain is built and before it's concluded, and it attacks a monster with the highest attack, it's destroyed and it will not destroy itself with its own effect. So that's a very, very important note to me here, which means that like, obviously this activates before Amarillo. So you see sub-step five, sub-step six, and sub-step five, sub-step six, which is very, very interesting that the, that it does work that way. Damage to calc still applies through. Now, if DD Warrior Lady is attacking Amaryllis directly, if it's attacking it, then you'll be able to banish with it. But I thought this was a very interesting ruling that I kind of wanted to share with everyone. I just kind of seen this here, and it just shows how Amaryllis can still pop its way through the great and powerful DD Warrior Lady. So please like, comment, and subscribe. If you want more of this ruling-based comment, please share this with a friend or someone who's trying to get into Amaryllis because this is a very important ruling to know overall. Peace. Have a great Sunday.